In this video, we're going to be covering two of our favorite supraspinatus exercises. Carter Kowalczyk here with the OAI, accompanied by Max Wardell, who's going to be helping us demonstrate two of our favorite supraspinatus exercises. So we're going to start with Max laying down on his stomach, arms hanging off the table. Make sure the table is high enough so that your hands don't hit the ground. And we're going to initiate this exercise by having Max reach up with his arm, keeping his shoulder blade down and back. At the top range here, we're going to have him turn his thumb down while protracting his shoulder at the same time, reaching as far out as he can and coming down across his body to eccentrically control the motion. Good. And one more time. Thumb up, rotate thumb down, protract, reach across the body. So the second exercise we're going to be showing you is the supraspinatus sit-up. I'm going to start with Max laying down. Pause the video right now and try out that first exercise we showed you and comment on our video below and let us know what you thought. And don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. So how we're going to initiate this exercise is we're going to have Max internally rotate his arm, thumb down, starting up. His arm's going to stay parallel with the ground the whole time. He's going to try to maintain that parallel position with the ground as he sits up, reaching for his opposite leg. And he's going to protract and reach as far as he can the whole time. Holding that protracted position, he's going to start to sit back down, controlling this motion the whole way. Good. And again. Good. Thanks for watching our two favorite supraspinatus videos. If you like those rotator cuff exercises, we have a free rotator cuff complete program on our website at overheadathletics.com. And if you progress through that and want more of a challenge, check out our advanced rotator cuff program on that same website.